you know, we're not going to reach the world or change things by having one speech after another. Things began to change when we began to sing about it, when we began to write plays about it, when we shoot movies about it, hmm. when we decide to take our power as artists and make change. That's when we're going to reach people's hearts. That's what we need to change. It's really possible, and it's up to all of us. Scripts, I guess a few months ago actually it's all everything's kind of happened real quick all of a sudden I get a call and he's like mom I'm coming to Philly and uh, I'm gonna be doing this movie okay. yeah I mean this is this is this is, this is real life marrying art I mean this is a, a real life march but this is a film called explicit ills that I wrote and directed uh, that stars uh, Tariq Trotter, Black Thought, Rosario Dawson, uh, Naomi Harris is over here, uh, Paul Dano from Little Miss Sunshine uh, this is my mom, Sherry Honkler, who's a real life organizer. Absolutely incredible, man. Everyone was phenomenal. I mean, it, it could have not gone better. I'm Mark Weber playing Lou Pucci. I'm Lou Pucci playing Mark Weber. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> No, Mark's the man, you know, like it's it's just a real pleasure to be able to work with somebody who is so invested and so passionate about everything that he does. Just makes like doing whatever it takes to, to make it go a joy. You know, he has been incredibly blessed, but also by being blessed and by given this opportunity comes a great deal of responsibility. We live in a country where there's plenty food and clothes. We live in one of the richest countries in the world. There's no reason why anybody should go without any of these things. My plan is to actually capture something that we really do and do it for real. What I really loved about this is that it was just kind of these, these beautiful, true stories that were intertwining around each other. A lot of the storylines and characters are somewhat based around actual people in his childhood and throughout his life. Addictive personality. It's better this than other shit. Contrary to popular belief, yeah. uh, I am not on drugs. They, they, they won't even say like that Mark Weber was kicked out of high school. You know, it's always like, 
and Mark from the Creative and Performing Arts, they leave it a mystery. <laughs> they would never tell the story of like Mark running into money and then distributing that money to help build a movement to end poverty in this country. They're not going to tell that. It's not sexy. I mean, it's a true story. The way he's using, you know, actors and integrating non-actors into the shit, um, it just makes it very real. It's not like somebody coming from outside the city who didn't experience you know, this whole struggle that the film is about. It's, it's as close to him doing his life story, you know what I'm saying, as he could come without it being in autobiography. Just like, you know, man, it's just is like, you know, 27 years in the making, man. in the KGB, so uh, no funny business, you already are.